Hello and welcome to the tutorial for creating a course backup and then restoring the course. So first of all, I will have to log into my admin account so that I have access to the site administration from where I want to create the course backup. Then I will go to the course and from the menu under course administration i will go to backup here you get a number of options to choose i will go with the default ones that have been selected click next and scroll down to click next here you can choose a specific file name for the backup file if you want but I will let it remain to default and then click on perform backup. The backup file was successfully created. Continue. Next step is to download the backup. So the backup of the course has been created and stored in Moodle itself. But we will have to download it so that we can restore it on another Moodle website. So for that, I will have to download this. As you can see, the file has been downloaded. Now I am going to log into the website where I want to restore the course. This is the website which does not has any courses as of now. Now I want to restore that specific course into this website. How do we do that is, first you will have to go to site administration, courses, manage courses and categories, create a new category. In case you want to create the course in the miscellaneous category, that is the default category that you get with the Moodle installation, then you can directly go ahead with restoration of the course. But I want to create a specific category for that. So I will click on create a new category. What is the parent category going to be is top category name category ID you can leave it blank if you want or you can add a specific ID so let's say 01 since it's the first category that I'm creating and you can add a description as well for the category and click on create all right so this category has been created but it does not has any courses within it. Now from the courses section under site administration, click on restore course. From here you can either choose the file that you created as the backup of the course or you can just simply drag and drop it here. Let's see. So this is the file that we created as the backup and I am going to drop it here. And then click on restore. It is showing the backup details. Click on continue. Here you have two options. Either you can restore as a new course or you can restore into an existing course. So I want to create a new course and when you are restoring as a new course, you have to select the category where do you want it to be. So I want it in the programming category and click continue. And next, these are the course details, that is the course name, 
the course short name course start date so you can decide if you want to change any of these and next perform restore the course was restored successfully clicking the continue button below will take you to view the course you restored so let's see all right so i have the course here with all the four modules let's go to the module okay and i have all of all of the activities and resources that i had in the course everything has been restored and that's about it so this is how you back up a course from one website and restore it into another website for more such tutorials please subscribe to the channel thank you very much